Welcome to Devices Setup and today we will learn how to set up KJ Wi-Fi Extender Booster. So there are two ways to set it up. First is via WPS and second is via browser. Let's check the WPS setup first. So in this, plug the KJ Extender near your router and wait for around 120 seconds until it reboots properly. After that, press the WPS button present on the extender. Next, within 2 minutes, press the WPS button present on your router. You will then see a blinking LED on the extender and the router. After 30 seconds or so, the extender Wi-Fi LED or internet LED will get solid, which confirms a successful WPS setup. If in case you don't see LED on the extender, then it means the setup was not complete. So it might be possible that WPS is disabled on the router. So you need to first enable it. Watch video given in the description to learn how to do it. On the other hand, after successful setup, you will find new Wi-Fi extender network showing up in your Wi-Fi list. It will pick up the same name as your router's SSID along with plus or hyphen ext suffix in the end. Moreover, the password will be same as your router's Wi-Fi password. So you can try connecting your different devices to it and also unplug it and place it at the desired location. The best location should be halfway between your router and the location where you need Wi-Fi connectivity. Now let's check the second method. But before we try that, we recommend you to once reset the extender Watch video given in the description to learn how to do it. So after reset, grab your phone or computer and go to the Wi-Fi list. There you will find your Wi-Fi extender showing up. It will come up as KP300 hyphen some digits network name or repeater hyphen some digits network name. You can recognize your extender easily because it will be an open network without a password or lock symbol. So tap on it to connect to it. Once connected, Open a browser on the same device and into the URL or address bar, type 192.168.11.1 and hit enter. This will take you to the setup page of the KJ extender. Then it will ask you to select the mode. So select repeater or extender mode. Next, it will ask you to select the network name that you want to extend and type its password for verification. So there, select your router's network SSID, then follow on-screen instructions to complete the setup. Once done, hit save settings, and then you will see your extender will reboot. On successful setup, you will find your extender network again, showing up in your Wi-Fi list. It will pick up the same name as your router's SSID with plus or hyphen ext suffix. You can then connect your different devices to it, and during the browser setup, you can also customize your extender's network name as per your choice. Just in case, if you want better Wi-Fi speeds from your Wi-Fi extender, then we recommend you to set this extender up in access point mode. Watch video given in the description to learn how to do it. Lastly, if you found the video useful, then please do hit like and subscribe to support my efforts. Thank you.